I think there's such a joy in keeping a good home and watching your children grow up and cooking and cleaning and supporting your husband. Hey guys, it's Lillian here, the postmodern mom. I am the traditional mother or the traditional housewife of the postmodern family. And today we are going to see the Tudor House in Southampton. It's a home education day, which means we got discounted tickets and our daughter is gonna go see it for the first time. I don't think she knows much about Tudor yet. We haven't taught her about that time period yet, but that will happen this year or next year as a part of the classical conversation cycle. British history is in the curriculum for classical conversations, so it's not totally American and we're totally disregarding where we live or anything. There is the third cycle of the program, which repeats every three years, is um, all about native history. So we'll be learning British history while we're still here, though she will still be memorizing the American president. So um, yeah, I'm looking forward. I hope I can get some footage. We don't know, they're very protective about these things in the UK, so we'll see if I I can sneak some footage or not. Do you know what we're seeing today? A very old house. It's turned into a museum. It's right behind this church we've been to before. There it is. Do you see that house in front of us? We call that the Tudor style. Oh, look. How pretty. And originally, not anymore, but originally, the water, boats, ships, dock workers, was right beyond that wall. But nowadays, there's a big hotel there instead. <laughs>
What are those wall timbers you added over there? And what's wrong with them, may I ask? They don't hold anything up, do they? They just perish. No, no. Hi, pretty. My hat looks humongous. <laughs> it's so big. Nice Victorian kitchen. This is a hot water bottle. Leave them on. They wrapped it in like a sheet or a blanket type thing so you didn't get it. It wasn't uncomfortable. It's very impractical as a hot water bottle. Yeah. <laughs> So we made it home. I'm going to make lunch now. The kids are very hungry. Um, we had to leave around half 12 because my meter ran out and I didn't want to pay for more parking. It was already four pounds for parking. Yeah, I was really impressed by the, um, the tour and the tour guide. Uh, the guy, Andy, did the tour for the Sea City Museum, which is the Titanic Museum, and we missed it last week. But this is a part of the first time they're ever doing these. Home education day. So the guy Andy was very enthusiastic and really good with the kids and they prepared a lot of activities for them to learn about the time period and King Henry VIII, just a little bit about him and then we got to tour the house which I was really glad that we had a chance to at least look at it because they didn't do a lot of the touring of the house during the home education day, the activity. They um, We mainly stayed in this one education room that they set aside for doing children's activities I think and um, so afterwards we got to walk around a little bit and see what the museum is like and it was actually surprisingly big like I didn't expect to, there to be so many rooms and nooks and I almost felt like I was lost at one point um, but then we did find our way back I knew the, the house was kind of small I didn't expect it to be so confusing a little bit but I was also I love that they had a garden in the back I didn't know that they had a garden and apparently on Google Maps it's called the Tudor house and garden so it was really nice to see their garden in the back and then you can see the, the one of the, the original walls of Southampton pretty intact right right there like right behind the Tudor house yeah I would like to uh, take Felipe and see we could probably spend a lot more time in there than we did but we had to go and it was just nice seeing our friends and doing an activity with other home education parents though I didn't have any chance to chat with them that would have been nice hopefully you guys enjoyed me taking you with us on this home education trip to the Tudor house and if you haven't seen it yourself it's a really nice a house that they preserved really well and um, so I think there are some neat, neat, interesting things going on there. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a comment below and let us know what else we should visit here in Southampton area since that's where we're from. I'd love to read your comments. Don't forget that we have t-shirts for sale at teespring.com and you can always become a patron at patreon.com slash the postmodern family. We appreciate you so much and we will be making a video very shortly uh, thanking all of our patrons on Patreon. And I came out with a voice album of me singing British patriotic music as well as a selection of French music. They're two separate albums on everywhere. Google Play, iTunes, Spotify. If you just look up The Postmodern Family you'll be able to find us and they're not very expensive so I appreciate all of your purchases because I get 100% of that, um, what is it called? Revenue? It's not revenue. Rights? I don't know. I'm new to this whole releasing music thing. Thanks for watching. Bye! I think there's such a joy in keeping a good home and watching your children grow up and cooking and cleaning and supporting your husband.